stinks. <laughs> Welcome to the OC Homestead. I'm Donald and this is my son, Jonah. And today we are taking care of one of the nastiest chores I think we have on the property. And that is what? Uh, cleaning the chicken coop. Cleaning the chicken coop. That's right. So if most people, if you, well, most people, I say, I say most people, people don't realize that when chickens sleep, that's when they do a lot of the, uh, Right? Yeah. So, uh, all that food that they digested during the day, well, they're that out at nighttime when they're sleeping. And they sleep on roosts. And I'll show you these roosts. We built these roosts off of trees off of our own property. And it's a more natural way for the chickens to sleep because, one, it, chickens are forest animals and they uh, would normally live up in trees and stuff like that. But since we domesticated them, they, you know, don't have, they, they don't go in the trees anymore, you know, because one, we want to protect them. We protect them by building them a chicken coop. And this is the chicken coop here that you see on the video. And we built this chicken coop last year. And yeah, I realized we haven't finished painting it and all. We still got a little bit of paint to put on it. But uh, this chicken coop can house uh, upwards of, a hundred chickens, I think, is the square footage for it. Now, we're not going to overpopulate our chicken coop like that, but these roosts, here's the roost. These roosts, like I said, are made of trees from our own property. And what we did is we just uh, cut them all to length and then sandwiched them in between two two by fours. And then we took that the, the, the two two by fours and mounted them to the wall and mounted them to the ground at an angle so that it gives the chickens layers to uh of levels to that they can roost on and well while they're roosting at night time and, and here's some of their poo look at that mountain of poo jonah <laughs> so yes that is what we're taking care of today so follow along with us as we take care of this All right, so I went and grabbed the tractor. And the reason why is because we're gonna be taking a lot of that stuff out and we're gonna take it to our compost pile. So instead of making multiple trips with the wheelbarrow, we'll use the tractor's bucket, which can hold a third of a yard at a time. So, well, let's get started. Well, there's mama's thing for Lily. <laughs> Yeah, I think she got it off. How'd she get it off? I don't know. I just know she did. Okay, go ahead. Put these things Look at that goodness.
that's a load. Hey. <laughs> so that is one third of a yard of chicken. So now we're gonna go put that in the compost pile. Thanks. So here we go. These are wood chips that we got for free from uh, the utility company who was doing some tree trimming in the area. And we had them just dump it right there in front of our gate. And we uh, have been using this for bedding for the year, so far the year right now. I would say if you can, get two of their truckloads. If you're raising, you know, just, you know, under, under 50 chickens two of these truckloads uh, would be perfect for uh, almost all year round. Uh, as you saw, our pile is almost depleted and well, we're uh, at the end of the year now. So let's waste no more time. We got some hens that are trying to get out. John and I are gonna start putting this in there. Dust yourself off. <laughs> Jungle. 
Oh, ladies are going to come check out the new digs. And there you go. All the material has been replaced in here. And it smells a lot better. Ain't that right, ladies? Ain't that right? Ain't that right? That's one of our newest tins right there. You can tell by the purple leg band on her. And that she has feathers. <laughs> no, 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 honey. This is one of our older hens. You can tell by the red leg band on her. So, if you like these videos that we're making for you, and hey, these are hard to make right yeah if you like these videos please give us a thumbs up right thumbs up. ring that notification bar and a bot bell uh-oh someone got out and uh subscribe to our channel for us it would really really make us happy right yeah yeah hey also visit our website theochomestead.com uh, and you can look at some of the live cameras of our pigs we got going 24 7 and uh, even we have uh, uh, here going live on our YouTube uh, we have a live that we have from time to time that is showing uh, both Miss Piggy camera and the piglet camera so check those out but yeah go to our website theochomestead.com right here read it see the OC homestead and uh, check out that live cam Right. Yeah. All right. Hey, thanks for watching and uh, have a good day.